I feel great. Um, it's a crazy race, you know, the first 450, but I just told myself to stay focused and do what you have to do, and I tried to lean through the line, and I got in, so <laughs> I'm happy about that. Did you see all the bumping that was going on in front of you? Yeah, I did, because it was hard for me to get around them, you know, so I just... Like my coach said, just don't worry about the mess, just stay focused on you, and that's what I did, and I moved when I could. Yeah, was your decision to stay back because... You yeah, all the mess, yeah. I was like, stay back a little bit, and then just come through kicking like the last one through. You were talking yesterday about how you had nothing to lose coming yeah. in. Now you really have nothing to lose because yeah. you're in the World Championship final. I mean, right. Can you believe that you've gotten to this point? Um, I mean, I've been working a lot. I kind of... We always should believe in ourselves, and I believe as long as I ran my race and came out here and did what my coach said to do, that I would make the final. So, but I came in here with nothing to lose, and that's exactly what I'm showing each round. For the final, will we see a similar plan from you, kind of staying back early on and coming on again? You know, every race is different, so I, I go on the races and just see how it goes, and then just go with the flow. <laughs> do you like that though, where you're closing hard? Yes. Maybe being not up with the pace at the bell, is mm -hmm. that good for your skill set? Um, honestly, these last few races, if anyone's been keeping up with me, my closes has been better than they ever been before, because usually I would tighten up so towards the line, but my coach has been working with me through strip workouts and a lot of speed. So I did more speed coming into Worlds than I did strength, and it's showing. What would be a success in your mind for the final? Winning. <laughs> but, yeah, um, just um, finishing strong and doing well. <laughs> but we all want nice to win. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but I'm just going in and giving all I have. So I can't when, wait. It's going to be exciting. Yeah. When you didn't make the final at USA's, were you thinking this moment was going to be possible? Oh, I didn't because actually I thought, you know, my season was over. But when I got to the airport, someone texted my. Um, my agent and said that Sierra has the possibility of making it into the world if Aji wins Diamond League. So I was like, Aji, you have to win this Diamond League, just please, because you know, I ran the standard before I got injured. And yeah. I'm so happy that I did and I got here. Did you reach out to Aji, like off the USA's and say like, hey, win this final for me or anything like no, that? No, no. No, well, we communicate here and there anyway, so we always talk and laugh and send jokes, but yeah, I just, I knew she was going to win. I don't know if that sounds good or not, but she's a great runner. Yeah. So when um, I did hit her up after the final, and I said, dinner on me, thank you for winning. <laughs> yeah. Is it wild to you that you you didn't make the USA final, and now you, but you did make the World Championship final? It's really wild. <laughs> yeah. I'm, like I said, I'm happy to be here, and I can't wait till Monday. Yeah. Thanks, All right, congrats. Thank you.